Okay, awesome. It's... You don't really know what you're supposed to do. But again, I think that is intended. Just stumble around from day to day. Hey honey, we're on our way home from the hospital now. So if you wanted to preheat the oven starting in about 30 minutes, that would work and we could throw in that lasagna. Um, mm. Do you know how they celebrate off treatment oh. day? Like when kids are done with their treatments? <clears throat> I, I guess maybe you don't because you're not in the clinic as much as I am, but on someone's last day, they always bring them a cake and they sing happy off therapy day to you. Anyway, that happened today. I mean, it happens a lot, but today I cried. I just wanted that day so bad, you know? I just, like, Can we're not imagine. ever going to get that day. If he's better, we won't <clears throat> know that he's better. We don't get a day. Anyway, okay, call me if you can. Like, there's probably traffic, so I could talk on my way home. All right, bye. Bye. Again, awesome transition from walking uh, through the corridor, answering your phone, and then turning around and finding all this here. Oh, ha. what is this? Is that a racing game now? Ugh, okay. Steer to over here. Yeah, that is. Is that boost? Ah, no steer to. What? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> go there. Go left. Left. Why don't you go left? Left. Whoa. Okay. Um. So I can. I'm. I'm trying to steer, but it doesn't do much. Ow. Now it does. Okay. Oh my god. It showed me I should steal with the mouse. Oh, I can't. Sorry. Whoa! I thought I had to steal with the mouse buttons, but actually it was just moving the mouse. Yes. Made it anyway. Okay. Nice. So they do that for. Every children that leaves. Well, how long is it going to be before we can have some answers? Did anyone ask the doctor? Okay, is it just doctor on call or is this our doctor? Well, because the on call doctor is just a resident. Is there a way we could talk to our doctor? It just seemed like yesterday in the clinic they were going to let us go. I just want to know what the plan is. Who canceled the treatment? Okay, so he isn't treated anymore. And yeah, the blackness returns. The world of the family starts to fall apart. Am I supposed to go out here somewhere? Or back in there? There we have you again. Hey, Joel, how you doing? <laughs> Way back disappeared, all right. And we proceed. The Temple of Man. All right. Is 
So, light please. What do we have here? That is now Joel back again. Or when he is four years old. They are obviously about two hey, it's you again. detect the and cancer. My friend. This is my favorite thing. Do you see? Watch out, start it. <laughs> That's right cool. Here, and the big lion comes. That's the scary lion. Nope. It's so loud. I can roar, that's like him. Yeah, I hear me roar. Why? Don't be afraid. You might want to no, cover no. your ears. Impressive. Definitely impressive. Here comes the animals. Tears is my favorite. Okay, what is that? Whoop! That is doggy. <laughs> that is a giraffe. And that? <laughs> Whoop! And what? And this? And that is doggy again. <laughs> Okay, I'm just <laughs> clicking everywhere. I don't know what to do. Boop, boop. <laughs> just make some loopings all day. Awesome. <laughs> so is that in in Joel's head now? I thought he <laughs> he was supposed to not be able to talk kind of but in the in his head he he damn well knows what is going on and what things are and what he enjoys to do and that is the most important thing right <laughs> Waking up. So now... Uh, still not at home, still hospital, is it? And Joel is... This terrible routine. Smaller Watching again. Watching you. Waiting for you to wake. Hoping you will never remember these days of illness and treatment. One day, I'll bring you here. Show you your tiny handprints on the wall. <laughs> and you'll be annoyed that we all think of you as some big miracle. Cancer will be such a small part of all you could grow to be. You will tire of hearing about it. You won't want to see the cards and notes I saved. And I won't mind at all. 
I'll hold the memories of this hard day. Oh, he has you pretty big feet. Just leave it behind. The fuck? <laughs> All right. So I wonder if that is. All this is real, like that, kind of maybe being a real place, a real wall in a, in a hospital that the developers had oh, a connection to. Messages do they? All right. Talks to all my uh, UIHC kids and families. Nice. Nah, just had that. Stop it. Put it down. To my hero, Henry M. At least Seward. Wow. These all, you can look at them all. So many. God. That is sad. This is really sad. Oh, God. That must be one of the toughest jobs working in a station like this as a doctor or nurse. Seeing like all, all every one of these here of these cards represents a story even more than the pictures before that are gone now anyway Sorry, guys, it's not good. <laughs> hey, Joel. How are you doing? So, okay. you want me to uh, spin the piggy, horsey, jockey, cow wheel? All right, let's go. Hello. Uh, horse. What an awesome thing it is. Farmer Bill dresses the ducks like superheroes. <laughs> what about the piggies? Farmer Bill enjoys a mud bath with the pigs. <laughs> <laughs> you like that, huh? The cows eat ice cream for dessert. <laughs> Cows don't do that. <laughs> Maybe the cows in, in the Ben and Jerry's commercial. They eat ice cream, yes. What about the horse? The horse has invented a new scripting language called Equiscript. <laughs> <laughs> you understand that one? <laughs> okay. Those mischievous pigs are napping on Farmer Bill's couch. <laughs> <laughs> 
Damn pigs. Barbara Bill owns the cattle on a thousand hills. <laughs> Why is that funny? And duckies one more time. Barbara Bill separates the sheep from the goats. Sheep go to heaven. Goats go to town. I'm sorry Nothing. guys. Oh. It's not good. Okay, so now we spin the wheel to see or to hear their thoughts, maybe. No, 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 no. Where is it? Size matters. If I know how big it is, I can, I can face it. I can size it. That's quite small at this point, but unfortunately the size isn't terribly important. Any recurrence means the chemotherapy has failed. This is a tragedy. God. I guess I have imagined it. I've imagined it a lot, but not like this. It's different. I thought I would sob uncontrollably or puke just right on the floor. I thought I'd shake or wail or something. I guess this is shock. Tragedy, he said. That's right. That's the perfect word for this. It's a tragedy. I wonder if he says that every time. He's crying a little. I love him for that. He's not callous. He's genuinely sad. She is too. So there just aren't any treatment options that are curative. Oh, God. Well, then let's see if he really cares. We're very good at end-of-life care. We're very end good at managing the pain and masking symptoms at the end of life. How long are we talking about? Prediction time again. No matter what I say, they'll wish it was longer. But sometimes longer is worse. A few weeks to maybe four months. Oh God. Is Nick crying? I'm <clears throat> just imagining How this is terrible. How am I going to hold it together now? A few weeks to maybe four months. Raining outside. Science, it's simpler. Measurable. More raining inside. Beam. And I get this result, and I can do something to control it, or at least have the sense that I'm controlling it. But now all we have left is a miracle, and miracles are fickle. They don't always come, and we don't always know why. What if Joel's miracle doesn't come? I, I hope he lives. I've always hoped. Now I can't do anything but hope. Oh, radiation. At least we can do something. Hope doesn't require signing papers or driving to hospitals or holding Joel in my lap. Hope is for something someone else has to do for us. When doctors can't, I guess what Jesus must. We're so sorry. Incredibly, incredi incredibly well done this game, or this story. Strong picture here. The rain inside your head, and the water going up and up. You're about to drown. 
push it back. I'm sorry, guys. It's not good. Okay, so... Let's listen to him first, then. Parents always ask how big. Wrong question. They should ask where it is. Location is everything. Slow death or quick, symptoms and losses all come down to where. Well, it's it's in the frontal cortex. And it's quite small at this point, but unfortunately the size isn't terribly important. Any recurrence means the chemotherapy has failed. This is a tragedy. Next. With an ATRT, as soon as you have a recurrence of any kind, it is fatal. It's only a matter of time before it spreads to several locations. We've already thrown all the chemotherapy we have at it. We can't continue to give him chemotherapy that we know it's resistant to, so there just aren't any treatment options that are curative. We're this very not good what I wanted. at end of life care. We're very good at managing the pain and masking symptoms at the end of life. How long are we talking about? A few weeks to maybe four months. Oh God. Science, it's simpler, measurable. I give A, B, subtract C, and I get this result, and I can do something to control it, or at least have the sense that I'm controlling it. But now all we have left is a miracle, and miracles are fickle. They don't always come, and we don't always it's know. interesting to see when you jump into come. the heads of all them. I hope you all these different people how they no, react. Do anything so the dad here is radiation. At least we can do something. Just listening to his head he papers or just driving to hospitals. Can't or even listen to what they are that. saying. Hope is for something someone else has to do for us. And when doctors can't. Invisible Jesus must. We're so sorry. Go, Invisible Jesus. I hate this part of the job. The impotent confession of failure to parents that are still trying desperately to hold on to hope for a breakthrough. They're not wrong. We'll find something. We'll get better, but not in time to help Joel. I wish they wouldn't thank us for bad news. Where is it? How big is it? Well, it's in the tunnel center. And it's quite small at this point. So that boat was the last bit of hope for Joel. Let's get to here. Okay. I strongly recommend uh, wearing headphones for this. It's just so much more immersive when you hear all the voices in your head. 